so previously we have used matte button module matte button toggle module and matte icon module in our sample component let us try to uncomment these so this was the output that we have got so now every time we are going to add and use the new module of angular material then we are simply importing it in our app module and again we are adding it to our imports array so we are making it bulky our app module instead of this adding here each and every time the new module and the corresponding input array corresponding imports array we can go on and create our own module and import that array over here so for that all we have to do is to remove these imports from here and we have created a new file called angular module and paste it over here and we have to remove from imports array as well now we will have to create a new module and import that module in our app module ts so that our app, app module dot ts file is no more getting larger and it will simply import the one module that we are creating that is material module So these are the three modules that we have utilized in our previous example and now we have to create them as a single ng module now we have the bunch of modules over here in our material module and now we have to simply import this module over here and we need to add this in our imports array as well now you can see your page is started to work and there is no error in compilation so in this way we have created our own material module and imported that in our app module ts and now every time we need to add or utilize the new angular material module we will simply add over here and it will keep on imported in our app module and we are able to utilize those module in our application we are no longer going to add 
further more components or module over here in our app module we are simply responsible to add the material module over here 